show you guys about evolution while you're all sitting here watching. When I was in high school, I wasn't very good. My, uh, we didn't have very much technique in San Diego, in San Diego High School, where I went to school. And so uh, my dad used to take me to wrestle tournaments, and his, his genius coaching was grab his legs. So I didn't know what to do, what I was doing. And uh, let's see if I can grab somebody. Here, someone come up. I'll just show you. So I used to just shoot in, and I'd be on my hands and my knees. Go ahead and fall back. And I would stand up, and I would try to pick people up like this. Oh, <laughs> that, that was my high school double leg. So I got to college, and it uh, didn't work very well. It didn't really work that well in high school, but I did it because that's all I knew how to do. And so I got to college, and uh, my coach, Daryl Pope and TJ Kerr, they showed me a, vi a video of a guy by the name of John Azalea. He actually went to Cal State Vegas Road where I went to school. And he had a technique video where he used to shoot up and down the mats. And his, 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 uh, his, his uh, level change and penetrative step was you change levels, you step in between your opponent's legs, uh, knee over toe, back up to your feet. So I used to do that over and over and over again all the time. Just be wrestling here, change level, step, Keep up and down the room, just over and over and over again. And so that was working, I was practicing it, I was doing it, and then I started getting pretty good at the double leg because I was doing a lot of practice and competition. And I went back to teaching to some people and I started analyzing what I was, do what I was doing. And I was kind of doing all the things you, need you needed to do, but it was a little bit different. Because there's three things you have to do on double leg. And the first thing is you need to, uh, to change levels. Does everyone say that? Change levels. Change levels. Second thing is penetrate. penetrate. The third one is follow through. Uh, follow through. So there's three things, okay? If you can remember those three things, you can teach yourself any move, because that's all you have to do. What's the first one? Change. change level. level change, then? Uh, penetrate. And then? Uh, follow through. So there's a double. Any more questions? No, I'm just joking. So, are you guys all ready to, you all stressed and ready? Okay, so, I, I talked about uh, changing levels and then penetrating. When you penetrate, the, the worst you can do is go parallel to the ground. What I was doing in high school is I was shooting down like this and getting stuck, and that never works. So, when you change levels, you have to change levels, and if you can shoot and, and penetrate going up, you can have a lot more success than if you go straight. So. Um, in, in doing that, I figured what I was doing was I was penetrating with my back leg, hitting it down. You can see this knee over here? It's over my toe. And then I would drive. But look, look if, I, if I just put my hands down and get like this, what does it look like I'm doing? Yeah, I'm not world class sprinting anymore, but uh, back then. <laughs> no, but anyway, so you're here, you hit that knee, this knee is over your toe and you sprint. What's cross street Wendy's? You sprint all the way to Wendy's. Okay, you guys got that? So here you sprint, you don't get that from me. You sprint. And so, what are those three things we're talking about? Level change. Okay, so first one, level change. Level change. Penetrate. And then the follow through is you continue to sprint. We'll, we'll, we'll go through all the phases, but that's, Basically the double leg, and if you can just think of those three things, you can always figure out why it's not working. Well, I didn't, I didn't follow through. Well, I didn't, I didn't change levels. So you can really teach yourself how to do it. So what I want to do is I want to get everyone. Yeah, let's let's we'll all start on this side, and I just want you guys by yourself. We're gonna practice just getting here, like you're sprinting. Put your hands up, and you want this knee over your foot. You don't want to be like this. You think I can sprint real fast like this? Probably not. Here, and then we're just going to run straight ahead. Did I hit my front knee? Did I hit my front knee? No. And the problem a lot of you guys are having a real experience is you're so used to wrestling and you hit that front knee all the time. High crotch. We can single. So, this isn't a wrestling move, it's a football and a, and a, and a track move, okay? You guys ready to try it? Yeah. Okay, come on down. 